Hello and welcome. I made some new icons for Blender 2.8 so you can, I guess, remind yourself that you are running 2.8. Maybe you have different installations of Blender or other, you know, zip files that you extracted and now you need to differentiate between them. So I made these icons and you can download them from this website. It's in the description of this video. Just go to this button and press download zip and then just right click and uh, extract all. All right. And if you want to actually use it, use this icon, then just Pick the one that you like. I'm going to pick the, the gray one. I haven't tested that one yet. Pick the .ico file. If you don't see the file endings, go to view and file name extensions. View, file name extensions. You've got to see that. Put it in the folder with the Blender. And now I need to use a tool to replace the icons in VXZ. I'm going to use Resource Hacker. And uh, here, when I start it, I can drag in an .exe file and I can go to Action, Replace Icon. And I'm going to just say Open File with New Icon. And then I'm just going to copy this path, paste it in here. And I'm going to scroll down to the icon and pick it here. Blender icon 28 gray. There we go. Let's press replace. And now I'm just going to press save and close it. And nothing, nothing happened. If we zoom in, we cannot tell the difference yet. Here's the Blender file. Here's the original file. So to update this, first of all, let's try a view file and extensions. No, that didn't help. So instead, what we have to do is we have to restart um, Explorer. We can do this with Task Manager, for example, in the Details tab. Just right-click Explorer. You can press E, X to find it, and then End Task and End Process. And then you have to go to File, Run New Task, and type in Explorer. This closes all the windows. And if we go to the folder with uh, the .exe file again, okay, that didn't help. Let's uh, rename this file. Let's rename it to Blender 1. Okay, now we can see the change. Now let's rename it to Blender with a big B. That didn't help. Let's rename it to Blender. Whoops, Blender and reload. Still nothing. What was we had to do for that? Oh, well, I guess we're gonna have to restart Windows. Okay, I'm back from restarting. Okay, I have restarted the computer and it didn't help. Well, I guess it doesn't matter that this icon doesn't change because when you link to it, these things do change. Oh, I guess the problem here was that there was a file association with this exe file, so it was treated as some kind of holy grail by Windows, I suppose. So just click on a blend file, go to properties, uh, opens with and change that to some other program and then back to, you know, Blender 2.8. This has been driving me insane. I hope this was useful to you and I hope you've understood this crazy solution to make it work. This is how you change your icon. Enjoy the icons. Let me know in the comments uh, if it worked much easier for you because maybe my Windows is especially stupid. Uh, subscribe and give this video a like if you're up for it and I will see you next time. Until then, ciao.